Hello everyone. Namaste. Welcome to my yoga channel. My name is Yulia and today we are going to have a rather active practice. So, without further introduction, let's start at the beginning of our mat, standing. Please come to the beginning of your yoga mat, feet a little bit apart, somewhere around 5 centimeters apart. Push away from your yoga mat and feel how that movement actually energetically pulls your hips together, pulls your quadriceps, uh, it's getting activated, your tailbone points downwards, activate your pelvic floor, activate your belly, make one big circle with your shoulders up and back, let your shoulder blades come together and close your eyes. Relax your eyes, relax your jaw, relax your shoulders, Direct your attention to your feet, to the soles of your feet. Feel the touch of your feet and the yoga mat. Travel with your attention to your shins, your knees, your thighs, hips. Become conscious of your spine, of your back, your arms and hands. Become aware of your belly, chest, neck and head. From the tips of your toes to the crown of your head, your body is whole. Gift yourself this moment. your own sensations. On the next inhale, bring your arms up. Exhale, arms are making one big circle back. Inhale, up. Look up. Exhale, arms go down. Inhale, up. Exhale down, inhale, bring your arms up, interlock your fingers, let your palms point to the ceiling, take a deep breath in, open your breast, breathe out, round your back, bend a little bit your knees, deep inhale, open your chest, open your heart, exhale, round your back. One more time. Deep inhale, try not to bend your lower back, but rather open your heart. Exhale, round your back. Inhale, stretch the spine. Exhale, bring your palms to your thighs, bend a little bit your knees. Inhale, forward, open your heart. Exhale, round your back. Inhale, open. And exhale, round. And one more time. Inhale, open your chest. Exhale, round your back. Inhale. 
Inhale, open your chest. Bring your shoulder blades together. Let your spine, let your back be straight. Exhale, shift your arms down to the floor. Inhale, palms wander on your shins. Stretch the back. Exhale, forward fold. And one more time. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, forward fold. And we stay here for a couple of breaths. Relax your neck, relax your shoulders. Let your sitting bones come in different directions. The knees are still bent. This is our first forward fold. Bend as much as you want. Feel your body whole. On the next inhale, look forward, halfway lift, lift your chest. Exhale here. Inhale, bring your right foot back. Exhale here. Inhale, look up, rotate your shoulders open. Exhale, bring your right foot to the left, forward fold. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, here. Inhale, left foot back. Exhale, here. Inhale, look forward. Exhale, bring your foot forward. Inhale, halfway lift. And with your arms on your sides, come back up, look up, open your chest. And bring your feet down. Oh, arms, hands. <laughs> Sorry. Take a deep breath in here, become aware of your body, of your heart rate, deep exhale here, on the next inhale bring your arms up, exhale with control, arms stay where they are. Bending our knees, we start to come to forward fold. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, we bring our right foot backward. Now, right foot is very strong, left foot is very strong. We push our left hip a little bit backward, right hip. A little bit forward and without changing the position of the leg legs lift your body up here point your tailbone to the floor maybe you will need to come up a little bit your right quad is activated take a deep inhale here Deep exhale, and on the next inhale, bring your palms up and look up. Exhale, shoulders go down, shoulder blades come together. Deep inhale here. Deep exhale, breathe. One more time, reach with your fingers to the ceiling. Exhale, bring your palms to the floor and bring your right foot forward. Ah. 
Arkhantanasana. Halfway lift, lift your chest. Exhale, bring your left foot backwards. Now find the center, right hip a little bit to the back, left to the front. We keep our quad strong and activated and then we build tall body. Deep breath in here. Pay attention to the way your hips are positioned. If needed, come up a little bit. Deep exhale here. And on the next inhale, lift your arms up. Exhale, shoulders go down, shoulder blades come together. Inhale here. Exhale here. Inhale here. Exhale, palms to the floor. Now bring your right foot also back. Stay in plank. Take a deep inhale here. Deep exhale here. Deep inhale. And on the an exhale, shift yourself to the downward facing dog. Make one step forward with your feet. Mm. Breathe through this position. Rotate your shoulders open. Let your neck be nice and relaxed. Try to reach the ceiling with your tailbone. Your sitting bones come to different directions. Your thighs rotate inwards and maybe your heels also rotate. Your heels are a little bit wider than your toes. Inhale, stretch. And exhale, find ease in the stretch. Inhale, look up. And come forward to your hands with one or two steps. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, forward fold, Uttanasana. Inhale, Uttva Hastasana, palms up. And exhale, Tadasana, mountain pose. Travel through your body with your attention. Notice the changes. On the next inhale, arms up, look up. Exhale, bring your hands, your fingertips to the floor. Inhale, lift your body halfway. Exhale, make one big step backwards with your right foot. Inhale, lift your chest, lift your body, lift your arms and bring your palms together if you can. Shoulders sit down, shoulder blades try to come together. Shoulders rotate open, we open our chest. We look up and we make sure we don't bend our lower back. One more deep breath in. And on the next hand, bring your palms in front of your chest center. 
Now put your right foot on the floor, a little bit inside, let your toes point a little bit inside, your left knee um, doesn't cover your big toe. So you see your big toe when you look at your left foot. Rotate your left thigh outside. So outside and feel how it changes the position of your lower back and of your sacrum. The right thigh is activated. Take a deep breath in here. On the breath out, spread your arms, bring your shoulder blades together. Look over your left middle finger and reach with your right hand back. Deep, breathe deep, stay present. Let the energy flow in your whole body. On the next inhale, stretch your left side Lift your arm, exhale, rotate your right foot, bring your hands to the floor and bring your right foot to the front of your mat, forward fold, relax. Let your inner side travel to your hips. And just notice what's happening there. On the next inhale, lift your chest. Exhale, bring your left foot backwards. Inhale, lift your body, lift your arms and bring your palms together. Breathe deep, open your chest, rotate your shoulders. And relax. With the next exhale, bring your palms in front of your chest center, rotate your left foot, let it be absolutely on the floor, even push the outside, um, the outside of your left foot to the floor, activate your thigh, make sure that you see your big toe and rotate your thighs outwards. Take a deep breath in here. Exhale, spread your arms, let your shoulder blades come together. Reach to the left with your left fingers. Look over the right middle finger. With the next inhale, stretch the right side of your body. Exhale, bring your palms to the floor, rotate your left foot and bring your right foot backwards. Plank pose here, shift your body forward, rotate your shoulders so that the elbows point backwards and Chaturanga. Upward facing dog and downward facing dog.
Remember the alignment. Heels reach to the floor. We try to rotate our pelvic. We kind of try to make a bend in our lower back, except we can't do that in that position, but we try. Look forward. Take a big step forward. Lift your chest, straighten your spine. Sink down into forward fold. Lift your arms up. Look up. And sink your arms on both sides of your body. Become aware of your sensations. Become aware of the energy flow. Does it flow up or down? To the center or to the skin. Open your eyes. Lift your arms up, exhale, forward fold, down, inhale, halfway lift, exhale, bring your right foot back, bring your foot to the floor, lift up here and straighten your left leg. Now the left thigh again rotates outside the right foot is very strongly glued to the floor we open our chest we spread the arms here bring the shoulder blades together and now we start to shift the right hip to the right and reach with the left fingers to the left and when we feel ready we come to the Trikonasana. You can place your hand on your shin, on the floor, or maybe on your block or a book if you have some. Take deep breath in here, stretch your spine from the tailbone to the crown of your head. Make sure you don't fall forward, but rather consciously open your chest to the ceiling all the time. Deep breath in here. Bring your right palm to the floor. Rotate your right leg. And bring your right leg to the front of your mat here, forward fold. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, now left foot goes back. We bring the left foot to the floor and we lift ourselves up. Now the right thigh rotates outside and feel how this rotation changes the position of your tailbone and of your pubic bone. So we rotate here and almost automatically our pubic bone comes to the navel point. Now the left foot is glued to the floor. Take a deep breath in here. With the breath out, spread your arms, reach into both sides, not just hang here, but rather reach energetically and start to shift your left hip to the left, your right fingers to the right 
And when you feel ready, you can bend your body. Again, make sure you don't fall to the front, but rather all the time try to open your chest to the ceiling. Keep this rotation, keep this activation in your thigh. Let the energy flow from your chest to your fingertips and up there to the air around you. Make sure even your fingers are active and your hand is not hanging. And with the next exhale, bring your left palm to the floor, bring your right palm to the floor. Make one step back, come to plank pose here. Take a deep inhale. Elbows point backwards, in, come down on the floor, all the way to the feet. Help yourself with your hands, bring your lower ribs in contact with the floor. Bring your palms here and lift your chest. Your chest down, shift yourself on your knees, tuck your toes and come to downward facing dog. Rotate your shoulders open, create more space in your spine. Maybe shake your head a little bit. And with your next exhale, bring your knees to the floor, cross them and come to sitting. Come to sitting. Move your hips a little bit forward, take your thighs and come on your back. Bring your feet to the ceiling. We are going to make a laying forward fold. So bring your hands on your feet if you can reach, if not, Bend your knees, make sure that your back is on the floor. Make sure that your lower back is on the floor as well. This is a variation of a seated forward fold if we were sitting with absolutely straight spine. Exhale all the tension out of those areas that are feeling the work right now. And bend your knees. Bring your shins parallel to the floor. Bring your arms on both sides of your body, palms face down. And let your knees, let your legs fall to the right, look to the left. Inhale, come to center. Exhale, let your legs come to the left, look to the right.
Inhale, come to center. Bring your feet to the floor. Lift your hips, lift your chest. Tuck your shoulders a little bit under you. Take your ankles if you can. If not, uh, maybe interlock your fingers and let them lean or maybe just let your palms rest on the yoga mat and with every inhale lift your hips a little bit more up and with every exhale integrate this position with yourself Exhale, left, let your hips sink to the floor. Now listen to your body. Maybe there are some movements that you would like to make. Get ready for a relaxation. Stretch your right leg, stretch your left leg. Move to find a comfortable position and then don't move anymore. <laughs> Relax your head, your forehead. Relax the skin of your head, relax your hair, ears, eyes, eyebrows. Let go of any tension in your nose, in your cheeks, in your jaw. Relax your neck, throat, shoulders, elbows, forearms, wrists, palms, and fingers. Let go of any tension in your back in your shoulder blades, in your spine. Relax your lower back, your tailbone. Bring your awareness to your chest and your belly. And with an exhale, Relax your chest, relax your ribs, belly. Relax your pelvis, hips, thighs. Knees, shins ankles and feet. From the crown of your head to the tips of your toes, your body is light, relaxed, healthy
Begin to slowly come back. Become aware of your breath. With your awareness, find your toes. Start to move them. With your awareness, find your fingers. Move them a little bit. Stretch your arms, stretch your legs. And rotate to the right. And press yourself up with your left heel. Oh, my cat really enjoys Shavasana, so she's there. As usual, thank you very much for rolling out your yoga mat, for choosing to make this practice. I hope you enjoyed it and activated your body. And yeah, leave a comment down. Tell me, how did you feel this warmth and this activation? And see you next time. Bye-bye.